Well, the one I've been to, to catch up with the video of the year. Uh, as you can see, I've been busy on the back here, sorting out scenics. I've left a cap there, I'm going to put a bridge in there with a railway crossing, with a bit of a road system. So that's the plan there. Uh, it's all coming out. We've also been doing a little bit up here on this bit of a tunnel, some bridge is going to go in here. Probably be a road going across there. Um, I've only put this up so I can place that on top, really. Uh, it's got a, it's got have this works built up. So it, you know, it doesn't look so it's like it's straight on top of the same as that one down there on the on the on the other one. It's got a earthworks around it, <clears throat> and there's the other side. It's only a temporary sort of framework. Um, I've screwed and glued it so I can get them screws out tomorrow, and I got something to work with then. That's just a basic shape. Um, <clears throat> so I got <clears throat> something to work with. Um, We'll see, we'll see what we get on with that, but that, that's just it. It's just a very loose, basic sort of setup. So there, that's that. Um, what else news have I got? Everything's running. I haven't run uh, any change for a couple of days, but everything's running okay. Uh, we've got a development down here on the O. Um, we're changing over to DCC next week, hopefully. I've ordered a uh, control system with Dar Darwinist Ultima, Bachman, um, rails of Sheffield have got them up for sale for 149 quid. So I thought, I'll have one, I'll get myself one of those at that money. They're split apparently from the Pullman set. Kurnu also, also uh, got them. so. I jumped on one of them, so that that's giving the impotence now to get on with the DCC down here, so I can get rid of these analog controllers um, and replace them with a DCC system. And um, you might notice that the high mech is missing. It's gone. No, I haven't sold it. Um, I boxed it up. It's been taken tomorrow. To uh, GL, GLR, I think it's called, in Barry, which is my hometown, Barry, so it will. And the guy is going to fit the chip in there for me, a sound chip in the Hymet, um, next week. So I'm going to drop it over there tomorrow. And I've ordered a chip for this one, that's easy to fit, I can just stop. The top comes off and you fit the chip in, 21 pin. And also, where is it? The pannier tank. Um, that's obviously got a chip that's going in as well. So it'll be all DCC. I've only got the three locomotives at, at the moment. But they'll be DCC'd up. And um, I can get rid of all these switches and sort the wiring out. And uh, yeah, I should have enough amps to run the HiMEC and one of the um, other locos with the uh, new controller, the Dynamis, I think it's called. So, yeah, looking forward to that next week. So I'll leave you with the trains. That's, that's all, that's everything. I've got some static graphs come in to finish that off. And over the other side, which I've just done. And to finish the rock off up there. So, you know, everything's, everything's in the pipeline. I'll leave you with the trains for two minutes. Going over the suspension bridge. My next big project.
catch her again. When they're up and running, maybe, on the CCC. Bye for now. Thanks for watching.